I'm Alex. I'm Brianne. And uh, we met Brian um, uh, a while ago, actually. I met him at an open house, and uh, he just got our contact info and just kind of said, like, hi, I'm Brian, and just that sort of thing. And a few years went by and nothing uh, really happened, but uh, w when we were looking for uh, to sell our place and looking for a house, uh, I'd seen his posts on Facebook a lot about how he was always selling over asking and buying under asking, and we just knew that he was somebody that could work for us. So I said to Breathe, uh, I know this guy, let's talk to him. Uh, he came over, I met with him for the first time, and I had a really good impression of him. He was really nice, friendly, uh, really open. So then we started the process of looking and selling our uh, condo. Then fast forward, to some time later, we start, really started looking for a home uh, and being in Kitchener and Waterloo was a little bit difficult, trying to um, outbeat the market, but Brian was super patient, really open and honest. Uh, what I really liked was we were, we'd ask him questions like, uh, what area of the city was is it like? Because we didn't grow up in Kitchener, so we wouldn't really know. Uh, Kitchener and Waterloo that well in some of the areas um, and he was really honest about it with us and he knew our goals and he always kept those in mind when we were looking at places and yeah he, had, he listened to everything that we had to say and yeah. what we wanted and what we needed um, and as that that even changed as it went on a little bit mm -hmm. um, and he just constantly was working with us uh, no matter what um, he was always excited uh, yes. with us, <laughs> um, you know, being really pumped up for an awesome place or when we were ready to sell or um, when we found a place that we thought we needed to make an offer on. Um, mm -hmm. yeah. Well, I really liked how he always was able to reply um, pretty quickly and... Immediately. Yeah. Immediately, yeah, yeah. Um, and just how, yeah, just how excited he was and his energy and he's always, like, he's He's a family man, so we really value that in him because we want a family one day as well. And um, he was able to help keep our goals in mind, which when we were looking about selling our place and buying a place, I was really nervous about getting a realtor who just thought about us as just clients and money, where Brian thought about us as people. So yeah, he, he sold our place as if it was you know, a million dollar mansion. <laughs> um, it didn't, it, it, it made it feel like we were worth it. Yeah, which is what made the whole difference is that he, he made us feel like we were like the most amazing clients and honestly could not have asked for a better realtor. He's way more personal than a lot of the realtors that we saw because we saw a lot of open houses. Yep. It was easy to yeah. talk to, easy yeah. to get a hold of. Oh, I, yeah. you know, first started off emailing him, but it turned into a Facebook message with the three of us, and it was just constantly yeah. back and forth, and, um, you know, and, and he's really good at listening, like, he doesn't, yep. he doesn't force things on you, like, he listens, and, like, he really understands, like, what you want, and that's something that I really valued in a realtor, and that's why I don't think I could probably go with anyone else. Nope. Yep, he listens. And honestly, we'd probably use him again if we oh, were to sell 100%. our home. Oh, 100%. Yeah, in the future, I think when we might want to move from our next place or um, you know, any friends who are looking to move, we, I already know that I'm going to send him their way. One of my favorite stories with him is we were, we were looking at, it was actually our first viewing uh, of a place that we were looking to buy. And we were humming and hawing about it. We kind of liked it, but mm -hmm. it was also not wasn't quite for us yeah um, and we were just I remember we were standing in the backyard and we were just talking about it and then Bree says yeah I don't I don't think it's it's for us and then he goes yeah you guys can do better <laughs> 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 so I just I just liked yeah. that he he knew what we were thinking before we were even thinking it yeah uh, he could tell I could tell by the look on his face that he knew that it wasn't for us and he was just letting us figure it out instead of telling us yeah. 
yeah. that it wasn't for us. Like, he let us decide. Yeah, he did, which was super awesome, but he's been so supportive, and especially through this market, and uh, I honestly don't think we could have navigated it without him. No, he made it really easy. <laughs> <laughs> We knew that the market was pretty hot. We we had um, a few other units in our neighborhood sell recently, and mm -hmm. and that gave us some good starting off points. But, yeah, but we um, so it kind of gave us an idea of what we were hoping for, and um, throughout the whole process, um, I think I think because he was able to market it the way he really went out with marketing our place to the point where like I even had co-workers who oh, okay, yeah. weren't friends with me on Facebook saying like hey like isn't that your place up on sale and I'm like yeah how did you find that <laughs> or like just like they're like oh yeah I saw it on Instagram I'm like oh I thought it was only on Facebook and yep, just my co-worker also saw it on Instagram it's just like how do these people find it it was unbelievable to yeah. see how far reaching it was um, so that was insane, Beyond I thought. what we expected, for sure. Yeah. Um, the whole process, again, we also thought that we'd get a few, a little bit of interest. Um, we had thought maybe, oh, anybody who lost out on buying another place a couple weeks before ours, that mm -hmm. they might come to buy ours instead. Um, we had over 20 showings in a week and nine offers. Yeah. And that blew us away. Um, yeah, we, nice. I'm shocked. We had no idea that's the amount of uh, but Brian, interest that we would have. But Brian was confident the entire time. I know you're nervous. Yeah. But <laughs> I don't know. I had confidence in Brian, so I wasn't I wasn't nervous about it. Just the way he carries himself. He's like, oh, we got this, guys. Like, we're 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 gonna do really well. And he's like really encouraging and. Yeah, I had to. I kept asking him, like, "Oh, what did you think? Or what do you yeah. think? Or what what happens next?" Or, um, but every time he's just very reassuring. He just kind of told yeah. us, like, everything's looking great. Um, I had, nothing I, to worry about. I had confidence in him. Yeah. I was like, "He's got this." Yeah, definitely. <laughs> definitely. <laughs>